Got a package. I think this is our pizza oven, our uh, big horn pizza oven from Amazon. I'm making some dough, pizza dough, in anticipation for tomorrow. It is uh, very well packaged. Whoa, looking good. This is a pamphlet. It's an undersurface. Four folding legs. Looks uh, very sturdy. Let's un unfold the legs. Looks very well made. Okay, here's the door. And inside is a chimney and other stuff. So the chimney has a crossbar that. Goes. There you go. Easy enough. Here's a handy handle. Nice. Cool. The pizza stone in there, pretty firmly wedged. It takes some work to get that out. Here's a, we can add power. So I think I have to take, take these screws out and tighten them. Like that. And uh, this is a pallet, pallet tray. Okay, it's fully assembled. This one you can measure the pallets. Here's uh, there's a pizza stone inside. Show you the inside of it. The chimney. This is where you can add more pallets. There's a pallet tray, and when it's hot, you can use this to pull it out. Cool. Put that in there for now. Okay, here's the pizza dose. Let it ferment overnight. So I have set up my uh, pizza oven in my backyard. I already tried it for lunch this afternoon, but it didn't turn out very well because I didn't read the instruction. So this is, I read the instruction. This is what you should do. Number one, keep that closed. Number two, keep that closed. Turn on, take out this one and put in uh, 300 grams right here. I have number one. This is weighed out exactly 300 grams of pellet fuel. Like that, 300 grams, and then uh, put it in. Then you should, well, before you put it in, you should take it out for me. I'm sorry. Put that out, take that out somewhere, and then light it. Light it with, uh, I'm, I'm gonna use a blowtorch, I mean, not blowtorch, butane torch. And then uh, once it's lit, maybe uh, two minutes, 30 to, I mean, a minute to two. Then when it's lighting, light it, then you put it in carefully. 
like that. And let it burn for about 18 minutes, it says. It will heat up the Tita stone and all that. So you will see uh, you will see uh, flame come out of that, that the chimney right there. Now after the flame come, goes down a little bit, I guess, 18 minutes, it says. Then you open this and dump in, uh, put in uh, 450 grams. I got these two, this is exactly two, 450 grams. You put that into the hopper and then uh, you close the hopper, let it burn. When you see the flame come out the second time, then it's really time to, ready to cook. So, okay, we'll give it a try. Not right now, I'm gonna wait another hour when my kids get hungry. So I'm using uh, this hardwood pallet, Traeger's, but you can use any. This is Traeger's uh, hickory pallets. You can use any. Make sure it's hardwood pallet though. It's time for dinner, time to light the fire to cook the pizza. I got 300 grams of uh, pellets right here. I'm gonna uh, hang like that for now. Hang like that. Let's light it. This thing is steel, it won't burn. <laughs> Okay, I think that should do it. Whoop. Hope it doesn't fall off. Okay, let it, let it light up. Look at good wind, smoke coming out. Nice wind. So I'm gonna push it in. Okay, it says let it burn for uh, 18 minutes. So right now it's uh, 10 to 6. It says you will see some flame coming out there. The door is closed. Oh, you see it, fire. Looks good. Looking real good. Let it do this, let it heat up for 18 minutes. Here my uh, pizza dough. Been uh, fermenting since last night. This one got deflated when I touched it. Okay, mm -hmm. okay fire is coming out. So that's all normal. Almost no smoke. So when it's burning, when there's flame, there's no smoke. Cool. So when the smoke, after 18 minutes, I will add this into the hopper, 450 grams of pellets into the hopper. And then when the flame comes out again, it's time to cook. At least according to the instruction book. Now it's uh, about time to add more fuel. It's about 15 minutes, 18 minutes afterwards. So I'm gonna add 450 grams of fuel in there. I'm 
but I need two hands to do this. I've added 450 grams of more fuel. Now it's beginning to smoke again. The, the instruction says when there's fire coming out, then it's ready to cook. Right now it's the smoke. I'm not good at making pizza, so got some pizza sauce. Okay, a little bit of mushroom. Is that authentic? I don't know. Mushroom with pepperoni pizza. I just want to eat mushroom. Okay. Put on the Okay. Okay. That's good. Okay, fire is coming out again, so I think it's ready to cook. Take a look inside, shoot. Ooh, okay. No. Oh, successfully launched. Okay. <laughs> I think we need to check that every 15, 20 seconds. And okay, good. Okay, yeah. How's it, how's it look? This time, maybe 20 more seconds. Okay. We're done. Okay. Okay. Let's see if it's ready. Put it under the light. Let's start to take it in house. Okay. Nice. You have to lift up his head first. Nice cross. With anchovy. Okay, anchovy. This is a mushroom. Uh, green pepper, bell pepper. Smells good. I found that after each pizza, you have to add some fuel. That's how you do it. Just a scope to scoop for. Like that. Oh, the, the bottom is perfect. It's definitely a learning curve. I think uh, I'll get better with time. This is not too bad for the first day. Thank you all for watching.